What's going on, Pack Horse family? Back at y'all for another one, man. And uh, I just had to come and drop y'all something, man, that's, uh, that, that, that was kind of spoken to me, and I want to give it to y'all, man. And listen, it's just like this, man. Christ is waiting to do something for you in your life, but first, he's waiting for you to do that thing he's speaking to you, Pack Horse family. I don't know what that is, but you do. He waiting on you to do that thing that's being spoken to you, that thing that's constantly on your mind, that thing that's constantly in your heart. He's waiting on you to do that thing in order for him to, 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 to uh, how, how I want how, how I want to say it. I don't necessarily want to say bless you because listen here, we get blessed every single day. We get blessed every time we wake up and get to see another day. We get blessed every time, every time. Y'all know where I'm going with that. But, but, but what I want to say is before he revealed the next level of your process to you he's waiting on you to do something listen here and i'm no different from y'all y'all know how i like to kick it i'm no different from y'all listen i i gotta come on here and confirm my call in my election every single time i want to i got i do these videos whether i want to do them or not sometimes i just want to cool out sometimes i don't feel like it sometimes i don't want to feel like it's being forced but at the end of the day it's not that baby i gotta come on here because it's my gift it's my calling to and, and to help y'all get to y'all next level in life and that's just what it is listen listen let's see just like that there sometimes sometimes things don't go as planned i ain't planning to drop the phone out my hand and it go tumbling baby but it did and i'm glad it missed that water right there it would have been all bad but listen here and i would have found a way to come back at y'all pack horse family but christ waiting to do something for y'all through the ups through the downs when it get dark and when it lighten back up he waiting to do something for y'all pack horse family understand what i'm saying so don't don't let your current situation whatever it may be don't let it don't let it keep you so down whatever it may be if you up keep going up y'all know how i kick it right but keep going along your path baby get your shovels out keep digging your path baby one step that keep 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 look look at some soil right there there's some things right there that you can put a shovel to understand what i'm saying that you got to keep doing that and keep going along further and further day by day step by step no matter when it get dark understand what i'm saying no matter no matter no matter when things may not be going no way no matter when it seems like everybody turning on you when it seems like everybody against you it seems like every time you take a step and every time you turn the corner and you think you making some progress it seems like it's another it's another person that's blocking and opposing you and they're going against you and you just don't understand why in no moments you got to stay true to yourself pack horse family because guess what you know the truth you know the truth but guess what more importantly the one who got the ultimate authority knows the truth. Understand what I'm saying? He knows the truth. He knows what's going on. He see everything that's done under the sun. He see everything that's done in the light. And he see everything that's done in the dark, Pack Horse family. And we can't get away from that, right? So when you believe, when you believe, you achieve. Listen here, man. I'm three years. Today is my spiritual birthday, Pack Horse family. I don't know if everybody, I don't know if everybody celebrate those or not. But today, out three years ago, today I was saved. I was dunked in that water, right? And my pastor, man, shout out to Aaron, the one who baptized me. I never forget that. When I when he put me in that water, he said, "Do you make a vow to disconnect from Satan?" That's what he that's what he said before he dunked me, and I made a vow, right? But just because you saved. And just because you saved and you accept Christ as your savior forever, that don't mean you're not going to fall. That don't mean you're not going to stumble, right? Oftentimes, that's when a lot of stuff start happening. A lot of obstacles start to get placed in your way. But only this time now, you move out of sense of confidence. You move out of sense of belief in, in the Most High, in His Son, the two bros up top, right? And you understand that if, 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 if you operate in, in, in the sense of belief that everything happened according to they will, over your life you get a peace of mind out of that pack horse family you get a peace of mind out of that even even when things don't go your way right because 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 things are not gonna always go our way pack horse family they're not gonna always go our way and we not gonna understand why they don't but we got to understand and accept the fact that everything not gonna go our way but what we hope for what I hope for is that it turns out for the greater good of everybody involved understand what i'm saying because we go through things we can't see everything in life that's happening and it's a reason for that because if we can see everything that's happening before us it might intimidate us so much so that we may not want to take another step in our life if we knew what was going to happen to us right at that time we may not want to take another step forward we might just stay right here standing still understand just waiting on just waiting and watching life pass us by 
And that ain't no way to live either, baby. Because in the Pack Horse family, we pure souls. In the Pack Horse family, we go continue to go after what we want. We go continue to manifest them up here. We go continue to be pure in our heart. We go continue to stay in action in our in our ways and in our every single days, Pack Horse family. And we go take some people with us, right? We go add people in the Pack Horse family. We go go out and get the knowledge that we got. We go share and we go do the best we can. But listen, listen, I just had to come and share that. Christ waiting to do something for you, but he waiting for you to answer that call, right? Because it's like this in life. We got two things. We got two things. We got something that we want to do, right? Right? I, I much rather just be putting pen to paper and, 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 and producing books and, and being the introvert that I am. But my call, my call, my call encouraged me to come on here and talk to y'all. My call encouraged y'all to tell y'all the different little stories that I'm going through and obstacles. You know, you know what I'm saying? But but we got to also, we, that's the other thing. We got what we want to do and we got what Christ wants us to do. And it's best when you get that call. It's best when you feel that call. It's just best to answer it, Pack Horse family. It's just best to answer it. And, 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 and don't go against it. Don't worry about all the other stuff and the politics in between. Like, if he called you to it, just know he go get you through it, Pack Horse family. Understand what I'm saying? But I had to come and drop that on y'all. And I'm about to get up out of the way. But y'all know I'll be back, baby. Peace, success, and prosperity to the pure souls in the Pack Horse family.